What is up everybody? Today it is near here and I wanted to show you guys how to fix this little issue up in the top corner that you guys see about texture streaming pool over budget. I'm sure if you guys have been working in Unreal at all for at least a couple hours, something like that, you probably end up running into something like this. And uh, it's really annoying, it makes all your textures look like shit. So uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to fix that permanently so you guys don't ever have to worry about it again. So let's get into it right now. All right, so first of all, this is really easy to fix, but what I'm gonna show you guys how to do is to be able to see what your texture streaming budget is and how to alter it within the engine itself. And then we'll get to actually going into the file and fixing it. So we come down here to our console command and we're gonna type in r.streaming.poolsize. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna hit space and then hit one. And that's just gonna set our pool size to one megabit so that it shows us how much we're actually using within our level. So as you can see, I'm right at about 100 MIB. I don't know if that's megabytes or mini bytes or whatever it is, but that's how much this world is using. So now I'm gonna come back out here and I'm gonna type in r.streamingpool again, dot pool size, if I could type right. And now I'm gonna set it to 1000 just for right now. That's how you set it within the engine. So you could honestly, you could come down here and put in 3000 like I have, and it'll reload all the textures. And that's, I mean, it's good for right now, but that's only gonna stay for however long you have the engine open. But if you wanna fix it permanently, what you're gonna have to do is you come up here to window and you're gonna come down here to output log and that's gonna open this output log. There's a button down here at the bottom, but that opens up a completely different uh, log, but you can still find the same exact thing through here if you just type in texture quality But what we're gonna do is we're gonna come to the output log. We're gonna type in texture quality and You can see it says texture quality at three two one and it shows you where the file is So it's it for me. It just says scalability um, So it took me a while to find it in my file But I'll bring the file over here real quick for me, I just went to my program files on my you know, local disk, went to Epic Games, UE5, Engine, and then to my config folder, and then scrolled down into my base scalability. And that's the file we're looking for. So we're gonna open our base scalability file. And what you can do is you hold Control and hit F, and it'll bring up your find command. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna type in the same exact thing that we were typing into the command box. So streaming pool dot pool size and we're gonna hit find, find next, and that is, this is what we're looking for. So, all right, we can move this over here to the side. So this is our first pool size. This is streaming pool for number two. Uh, this is streaming pool for number, no, this is streaming pool for number two. This is streaming pool for number one. Uh, this is three, and then this is four. Actually, this is not four, there is no four. But you can come in here and change these to whatever you want, depending on whatever your setup is or how much memory you have. Uh, for me personally, I've set it to 1400, 2500 for texture quality number three, and for number one, 800. Um, but this is a permanent fix, and you just come up here to file, you hit save, and now you're done. And so now, whenever you load your engine, you don't have to worry about it going back down and having that issue. So now, I should be able to just hit play. And now we have no issues at all. And now I can switch levels, I can do whatever I want, I can work in my editor, my textures will look fine, and I can do whatever I want. So I just wanted to share that with you guys because I know it's been really annoying for me, and I'm sure you know it's probably been really annoying for other people who just want to get stuff done in their engine and not have all their crap look bad. Um, so if you guys like this video, uh, do me a favor and leave a comment and let me know if you like a video on something else. But uh, I'll catch y'all later, and you're out.